hey, oh, oh, I'm about to get this first deal, hey, hey, I'm about to get this first deal, hey, hey, I'm about to get this first deal, hey, hey, I'm about to get this first deal, hey, I'm about to get this first deal, hey, 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 I'm about to get this first. What's up, Chosen Nation? I'm back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to go over the cheat codes with meeting with the motivated seller. I'm going to give you all the cheat codes, kind of like NBA 2K, you know what I'm saying, of meeting with a motivated seller. These are going to be the top five questions, top five get to questions, you know, just to really see if they're really motivated and get to the point. At, in the beginning, you have a script. It's kind of like when you get on campus for the first time. You got the everybody know who the freshmen are. You know what I'm saying? Like me, I had the glasses. You know, maybe you had contacts because you were just bougie like that with the you had the mat like Dora. I look like Dora the Explorer. You know what I'm saying? Probably the same height too. Uh, I had the mat. You know what I'm saying? I had the big old backpack with all the ten books. You know, biology, physics. I was carrying all that weight. That's why I got strong back now. But when you first start out, you have that script, you're kind of walking, shaking, you're nervous and all that, you mess up, you go crazy. But then I just start building that confidence, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get you to get that first deal, build that confidence. You're walking out on world like Peter, so to speak, on faith, you know what I'm saying? And after a while, man, you kind of get it down pat. You don't really need to really go over like step, okay, ask this question first, ask this question, all right, ask this. I was there, been there, done that, all right? When you get that confidence, these are probably the top five go-to questions you want to hit just with meeting with that motivated seller, you know what I'm saying? It's just, it's, it's going to come easier for you. So let me kind of hit these points. Now, uh, my mentor had, I think it was just a stepbrother. I know they have some kind of family relation. I believe it was the stepbrother. His name is Todd Toback. Great guy. Great mentor. I think he mentored my mentor. So, you know, he's a part of the family, all right? He has this podcast called No Limits Podcast, if you want to look it up. He knows a lot. He not only focuses on wholesaling, but he does other things like owner financing and all this other stuff. He's, he's, pretty, um, he's pretty deep into it. He's been doing this for years. All right, guys. So the No Limits Real Estate Podcast, Todd Toback. He runs the show. That's his name. He was the mentor of my mentor. So much respect, Toback. You watching, man? Love you, bro, from the bottom of my heart. Appreciate it. Um, so he calls this the five-step secret sauce of meeting with the motivated seller. I call it the cheat codes. It reminds me of just everybody was wanting those cheat codes when it came to NBA 2K. Any any NBA 2K fellas, even ladies maybe, from cheat codes did me wonders. You know what I'm saying? R2, R2, X. Yeah, sometimes it's made stuff up. You know, I, I, oh, it's a cheat code. I found out. I just, you know what I mean? This is a cheat code. For meeting with the motivated seller, all right? Number one, so important, people forget, people are human. Don't forget, people love to do business with people they like. So many times I go into a, a nail salon and I get a pedicure and I just don't like the attitude of the person doing my feet. They, you know, I'm like, I know my feet's crusty, but you ain't got a ching chong ching me behind my back. I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying. All right, you know what I'm saying? I finally met this one lady Maybe she didn't do it as, maybe she didn't do my feet as good, but you know what? I stayed with her and I loved her because she treated me like a human being and she didn't, she didn't speak no other type of language, even though she could have. She, she treated me well, gave me a Vietnamese coffee. We developed a good relationship, you know? It didn't, who cared about the skin color or whatever, background? Who cares? You know what I'm saying? She treated me like a human being. It was perfect. My point, when people like you, they will continue to do business with you. Even if, eat, catch this, even if you might not be as sharp as this person, you might think, you might think, oh, this big company, you know, they've been out here for years and they, they got a whole big company. No, 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 no. Don't ever lose hope or have, or ye of little faith, you know, have that confidence, trust God and he'll help you find those deals because I believe they might rub, some people might rub certain people the wrong way especially if people have big companies they get a little cocky they be like whatever i don't care how i treat you because i got a million a million other customers you know whereas you if you just treat everyone with respect and you treat everyone well and you build rapport 
they will do business with you. Trust me when I say, okay? Even if they don't, they might come back around. You just never know. They might tell a cousin, a friend, always walk in love with people, especially as a believer. You know what I'm saying? You should be loving people anyway. Just saying. All right, build rapport. Be genuinely, genuine, not fake, interested in people, whether you come up with a deal or not. All right, hear me? Talk about experiences, common stuff. If they talk about basketball, you maybe you could bring that up. Try to talk to them and try to fill them out and see, okay, if they bring up maybe, I don't know, Texas and you're from Texas, talk about that. All right? Find the common denominator. All right, don't just be like a robot with no heart. Especially if the person is, is older. Older people, like, they need conversation. They want a friend. I'm just being real, you know what I'm saying? Um, that's number one, build rapport, all right? I can't say that enough. Number two, this is what he calls the pain step. He is so right about this. Have the seller eliminate all options besides doing business with you. Yes, he is so right when I say, you want to build rapport and be nice, but then you want to just like walk away, like try to push away. Fellas, if you got an ex, a, 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 your ex just broke up with you, you want her back? Don't constantly text her. Leave her alone. Walk away. Ignore her even. Wait two days to answer. Not two days. Maybe a day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait a day before you text back. You know what I'm saying? Trust me. You know what I'm saying? If you if you chase some like a dog, not calling nobody no dog. Please, don't dislike me because I, I ain't calling you a no dog. I'm just saying. If you, I'm just examples. It's separate now. <laughs> If you chase a dog, right, it's going to run away. But if you run away from the dog, it's going to chase you. All right? Just saying. It just might bite you, too. So, like, run away. I don't care if this is, you don't have any deals yet. I don't care, man. You you have, you, you, you're you the cash buyer. You have money in the bank. Have that confidence. I don't care how you want to do it. All right? Questions like, why don't you list with the realtor? You know, have you have your child listing with a realtor? You know what? I know a few. I don't know. I know like probably maybe one. I mean, I know a few. You know what I'm saying? I, <laughs> why don't you just fix it up and sell it yourself? You know what I mean? I mean, listen. Here, here's a hammer. I can show you. So I mean, give me your hand. Okay, boom. It's that easy. It's easy. YouTube videos. It's all over. You know? You, you know? I'm sure you can. You can do it yourself. Get your own money. Or well, why don't you just rent it out? Everyone's renting these days. No one's really getting a house. Rent it out. Make some money. Have them eliminate all options. All right. Ask those questions. Trust me. So true. Number three. This is also so good, man. I'm telling you. All right. The what if statement. Make an offer without making an offer. He is so right. Soft pass. I talked about this in a previous video about um, objections, seller objections. He's so right. Make a soft pass. For example, say something like, I am not saying I could do this. I make my promises. I'm not saying I could do this, but <sighs> what if I wanted to give you, let's say your number was 80000 cut it in half, 40000 Always cut it in half. Remember that. Or what if I could pay all cash and close quickly? Or what if I could lease your house from you and take care of the repairs and maintenance? Now he's getting into um, owner financing and all that, whatever, you know, other stuff. I don't do that. He he did. That's fine. I'm talking about for me, I stayed. I kept the main thing, the main wholesaling. Yeah. You, know you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's just me. I like to keep it all one. That's, that's just, that's just me. Um, but if you're into doing other options maybe you maybe maybe you need other options in your back pocket i didn't do that but feel free you can look him up he can teach you this all right um i cannot me i'm all about the wholesaling i keep in my back pocket on the financing sounds good um but make sure you have all your contracts for that that's kind of separate I'm just, I'm just saying number four Confirm with the seller by making the offer their idea. You want to make it seem like they're in control. There's a negotiation book. It's called Split the Difference. Hopefully, I'll remember while editing this video to put it in the description below. It's called Split the Difference. You have to read that. If you're not good at negotiating, 
Please read that. I read it. All right, loved it. And I learned a lot. Um, but the, he's 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 dead on with this thing. Confirm with the seller by making the offer their idea. So, Mr. Seller, if I'm hearing you right, you want me to guarantee your payments for 24 months, and then the buyer, you know, and then uh, buyer your house of this is not even spelled right. I'm gonna make up my own. So, Mr. Seller, if I'm hearing you correctly, if I'm hearing you right, uh, you're saying that um. You want to you want to sell me your home for fifty thousand? You know you want to you want to kind of just reiterate what they just said to make it their idea. All right. Now if the seller says, Nah, bro, I didn't say that. I ain't say that, man. You know what I'm saying? Oh, whoa, oh wait, hold on. Don't shoot me, man. You know what I'm saying? Go back to question number three, the three step. The what if? What if I can make you? What if I can do this? What if I can, you know, uh, cut out? cover all the closing costs. What if I can cut out the, the realtor commissions, whatever, the what if statement, right? And then number five, you want to close and get the contract signed. Okay. Yes. Is this Nyla? Uh Oh, you want to say hi to my friends? Come on. Yeah, my friends. Come on. What you going to say? What you going to say? You gonna steal the show? Last time you had more views than me. Move over, like sit down. Say, okay. hey. You gonna say hi? Say hi. What you wanna? What you wanna tell chosen? So hi, chosen nation. I'm chosen nation. So cute. What's your name? Nyla. How old are you? And I, I'm, 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 I'm three. Okay, come here. Come closer. Tell me. Come on. Tell them. Tell them. What do you wanna tell them today? Tell them something. Um, I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm my friend with the sun. You what, you what? You got, you got to look him in the eye, look him in the eye. Say what now? I, 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 I just, I, I just say with the sun. You say with the sun? Yeah. Are you staying healthy? Yeah. Are you washing your hands and staying away from people during this time? No. No, what, what, no, uh, what, what well, you should be. You gotta wash your hands, Nala. You not washing your hands? So when you go pee, you don't wash your hands? Say yes. You better, you better say yes. You know. kid, this is kid, kid friendly. Say, hey. What? You, 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 you was just, you was just look at the camera. Right here. But the, that's the video camera. Alright guys, that concludes this video. I hope you guys learned a lot. Those were the cheat codes, aka secret sauce, whatever you want to call it. Alright? Those were the cheat codes for meeting with the motivated seller. Yes, Nyla. You, you, What's up? Um, what up? I, I, What's up? I, I want to tell you something else. All right. Is it a secret? Because I got to turn the camera off if it's a secret. I don't want them to know any secrets about me. Okay. I'm taking it to the grave. I I want to tell you when 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 I when I when when I'm a princess. When, when you you are you're already a princess. But, you were a princess already. But. I don't have a crown on my head. You do have a... You don't have a... No, it's a crown. That's the crown right there. It, it's a half bone. No, this is a crown. Oh. Dun, 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 dun. It's a crown? You have a crown. I'll get you a crown. Okay. I'll get you. I promise you, I'll get you a crown. I should have got it when I was in, uh, at Disney. Hey now, I'm going, I'm, I'm going, 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 i am going 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 Okay, let's say this is your only means to, 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 to money or whatever is how you eat. Maybe some of you guys are out, out of a job, so you, you, you fell back to this. Perfect. Still wash your hands, stay away from some people. If you got to go to a seller's house, you know, a mask won't, won't hurt. You know, I mean, I know. Uh, gloves, just, just be, just, you know, yeah. just be careful, all right? Yeah. But also stay in the word of God, all right? Yeah. You'll be all right. I love y'all. Yeah. Peace out.
Yeah. Plain, now I'm running to it. I wrote the vision, made it plain, now I'm running to it. And with the Lord on my side, I know I can do it. I can do all things through Christ, so I'm never losing. Man, I do it for my city, man, I do it for the poor. I'ma build trade schools for all the boys and girls, cause they need jobs too. Burger King doesn't cut it when you got rent due and trying to ball out on a budget. And I know people get big and they never look back, but I'm not other people, I do not follow the pack. Count it up. Do the math, I'm on a billionaire's path God gives me new ideas in my dreams That's cash, I invest in these shelters where the homeless live Wise enough to know that God blesses me to give That's why I rap the way I do to represent Christ If God can save my soul, then I can save a life Wings of an eagle, we were meant to fly We gotta love on each other, remove all the strife I was born for